Morning, it's Monday, Jer. Morning, it's Monday, January 9th. 10th? Yeah, January 10th. No, it's not. It's January 9th. It's seriously January 9th. Okay, say good morning. It's Monday, January 9th. Go back outside. Say good morning. It's Monday, January 9th. Good morning. It's Monday, January 9th, 2007. 17th. 17th. And me and Mom are going to stay up when who's going to win this college championship between Clemson Tigers and Alabama. So... I'll see you again some. What? What's I say now? What? What's I say now? Say good morning. It's Monday, January 9th, and tonight I is Clemson, Clemson versus, versus Alabama. Oh. That's right. Morning is Monday, January. No, you gotta look at the camera, babe. Okay. Oh, good morning. It's Monday, January 9th. Yeah. Morning is Monday, January 9th, 2017. And to tonight. Clemson Tigers versus Alabama. Morning. Yes, it's still morning. Okay. <laughs> All right. It is Monday, January 9th. And tonight is the Clemson Tigers versus the Alabama. Tied, right? Yeah. And I'm rooting for Alabama, and you're rooting for? Clemson! He's rooting for Clemson. Uh, by the time this posts, we'll already know who the winner is. But, I'm telling you, it's Bama. No, I'm telling you, it's Clemson. It's Clemson. Right now, we're waiting for Nick's van to show up. Also, if the, the winner has to shoot the loser team with Dad's Nerf gun. <laughs> yeah, whoever, whichever team wins, which Alabama win, is going to win, I get to shoot Nicky with the Nerf gun. If my team wins, I got to shoot her with my two, my two flip fairies instead of your two new Nerf guns. Yeah, two Nerf guns. All right. Well, you gotta put your hat on, babe. It's it's uh, cold outside. You're gonna be getting on the bus here in a minute. Okay. So can that's you, our excitement for today. What? Can you can you check the weather quick? Are you <laughs> done? All right. So that's our excitement for today. We'll see you a little bit later. Okay, let's talk about sports. My son Nicholas is a huge sports fan. Uh, wasn't up until maybe about a year and a half, two years ago, and he has been enamored with it ever since. Uh, he likes pretty much any type of sport you can possibly throw at him. He likes football, basketball, soccer. Uh, I don't know that he's ever seen hockey, but he'd probably like that too. Um, all in all, I haven't seen a sport that Nicholas has watched that he doesn't like. So when Nick really started liking sports, um, he would always pick his team, and his team was always the team that was winning. He never uh, never picked one out of the gate, or he would pick one out of the gate, and then he would switch halfway through the game. He was very fluid that way. Um, one of the things that he always really liked was having someone else rooting for the opposing team, because he wanted to know that he was winning or losing, and someone else was winning or losing. Now, granted, because he would always switch in the middle of the game, he was always winning. And of course, you were expected to switch in the middle of the game too. Um, he always really liked that dad, John, would be on his team, and he liked rooting against me. I don't know why, whatever. Nick and I have a really good relationship for the most part, um, but he really likes to root against me on sports. So last year, 2015 to 16 uh, season, Nicholas decided he really liked Michigan State. Michigan State had a really good team. They had an amazing run. They were winning and winning and winning. And then I think they lost in the finals to Clemson last year. I can't remember for sure. But for some reason, Nick decided he did not like Alabama. No offense to any Alabama fans out there who might be watching this video. 
but he decided he did not like Alabama. I don't know if it was because Alabama was favored to win, or maybe uh, maybe it's that Alabama beat Michigan State last year, so uh, Clemson was opposing Alabama. I can't remember. I'll, I'll look it up and put a little thing in here. Um, but he did not like Al. I think it was Michigan State versus Alabama, and Alabama won. And then it ended up being Alabama versus Clemson in the finals in the in the play in the final playoff game. So Nick was all about Michigan State, and of course, I had to root for Alabama. Uh, not a huge Alabama fan, not really a big sports fan at all, but I had to root against him. Um, Alabama uh, ended up winning, beating Clemson. Nick was heartbroken, but he got over it. Now this year we're having again Clemson versus Alabama. Now. Michigan State did not have as good a year this year as they did last year, but they, he still likes Michigan State. He also likes Penn State, uh, but Michigan State's still his favorite. But anyway, where we're at today is da da da, da Clemson versus Alabama as a rematch. Um, so of course, again, Nicholas is rooting for Clemson. I'm really rooting for Alabama. I'm sorry, Clemson fans, but I'm pretty sure Alabama's going to win. This time tomorrow morning, I might be eating crow, who knows. Um, but nonetheless, that's the background between Alabama versus Clemson in the Jesse Mack family. Um, all in all, I just wanna support my son. I love him. Neil's a sports fan as well. He, he really started liking sports, again, about the same time, about a year and a half, two years ago. Uh, so yeah. I'm outnumbered, three to one, male to female ratio in the Jesse Mack household, so it is what it is. But I, I'm there to support my kids, that's what matters, that's what I care about. I uh, just want them to be happy. So tonight we'll be watching Clemson versus Alabama. I might go to the gym for the first part of that. Neil works tonight, so John's not gonna be able to join me in the gym. Um, but we'll see how the day goes. Uh, I still haven't filmed that, that YouTube video that I wanted for another channel of mine. I was supposed to post on Friday. I'm just, I'm still sick. This is day 14 now, and I just still feel miserable. I, yeah, not good. Anyway, I will uh, see you all on the other side. So we're home. Uh, we've already eaten dinner, and uh, John and I are sitting here talking about our future and what we want for our future and what we want to be in our future and what we want to do for our future. And um, we've always talked about moving out of central Pennsylvania. Now we live here now. Uh, we've been here pretty much our entire lives, but we've always wanted to leave central Pennsylvania. Um, and uh, we made a bet, a bet. Well, actually, what we're doing is we're sitting here waiting for the uh, football game to start. So we're waiting on that. Uh, Nikki and I are still rooting for Go Bama. And he's rooting for the Tigers. Clemson Tigers. Go Bama. Go Bama. Go Bama. What? Go Bama. No. Go Clyde. Tigers. Clemson. Clemson. Okay. So, we're waiting for, for the football game to start, and John and I are sitting here talking, and uh, I said to him, I guarantee you that we will not be here in 15 years. And he's like, yeah, whatever, we're going to be here. And I'm like, no, I swear, we're not going to be here in 15 years. We will be somewhere other than here in 15, in 15 years. And he said, I want you to put that on your vlog. I want you to post it and not delete it. So I'm telling you the entire world that on January 9th, 2017, I'm saying that 15 years from now, which is January 9th of 2022, this family, the Jesse Mack family, will not be living in Central PA. Mark my words. You hear that, honey? 
what he says. Okay. We'll see how the game goes. We've got T minus one hour until the game. Nick, is it time for kickoff? Almost. Almost? Dad, who are you rooting for? I am rooting for the Tigers. Not Clemson, Nicholas. Not Clemson. Yes, Clemson. That's not fair. Roll <laughs> Tide. Let me show you what my demon is. Go Bamble. Let me show the audience what my demon is. Oh, you want to show the audience what your game is? It's Klaus Woya, and I got this new weird demon right there. So I'm going to try it and see what happens in the fight. Okay, is it time for, it's almost time for kickoff? Yes. Yep. What do you think, Nick? I think Bama. Bama! No, thank, no Bama for you. No Bama. Go Bama, not no Bama. <laughs> yes, no Bama. Look, Nick, go Bama! And they kicked off, Nick. What do you think? Yeah, they did. What do you think? What do I think? What do you think? I think it's bad news for the Tide. They lost the flip, and uh, Clemson deferred. So they're going to have to face Clemson going down the, uh, after, after halftime. And on top of that, they got an 18-year-old quarterback. What do you think, Wednesday? Your tail's wagging. What do you think? What do you think, Wednesday? Wow. Nick, I think Clemson's going down. Nick. Clemson's going down! Nah, nah, whatever. It's second down. For Alabama. All right, let's see how it goes. If we don't film anymore, it's because we got too hyped up for the game. By the time this video posts, you'll know who won.